See that? That is our, uh, that's our ghetto rig. That's how we'll re be recording all of analog control until further notice. I think it's going to work out pretty well. We had a lot of bugs to work out with this, this setup right here. We got it good now. So, everyone, welcome to the first- God damn it, the fucking cat. So, welcome one and all to the first episode of Analog Control filmed in her quality. <laughs> Higher. Her? Higher quality. Oh, okay. Her. Her well, quality. To debut this- For her pleasure. Mentis event, we'll be playing a very original game that I'm sure you've never seen before. Super Smash Brothers Brawl Subspace Emissary Campaign. It's a very original game composed of original characters not taken from anything else. Oh wait, no, that's a, it's the other way around. It's it's very derivative, although albeit good. Very derivative, but the way we're playing it is not derivative. Siamese twins, motherfuckers. <laughs> Let's go. Up, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. There were two more left rights after he stopped future me. Left right, left right. <laughs> he did it again. Okay, are we starting? Are we rolling? Oh, wait, we're no, rolling. Go yeah. back. Oh, so long. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're rolling. Rolling. Are we rolling? Yeah. When when did we start? <laughs> hey guys. Hey guys. Welcome back. Um, yeah, we're doing this. You already know because you got the intro. But that way, we did that like two <laughs> weeks ago. It's been a little bit. Uh, so, here's the story. We tried doing this the first time. Uh, <laughs> shit. We had to start it over. Uh, begin without no entering. Yeah, yes. Should we set up a me? I mean, should we set up a me? Not for this, but... Okay. We're gonna do hard, because it's gonna yep. get intense. Yeah. So, here's the thing. We tried this once before, and our recording equipment was not up to snuff. Still had to work out some kinks, but Very now kinky. we should be good. We did a whole Star Fox Adventures session. Yeah, that thing ran for like an hour and 15 minutes. Huh? No problems. Um, so we should be good now. So we're doing this for real. One part of the nunchuck in my hand, the Wii mode in his hand. On yep. hard, whole thing. If it gets too hard, we'll put stickers on, but we're not giving up. That's the important part, right? That's the important part. Okay. We were like surprisingly confident okay, so, at this. So who are we playing as? Mario? Uh, sure. Okay. We were surprisingly good at this in so the first attempt. You may so. see us will be a little practiced at this, but yeah. Okay. I'm... Am I really gonna say that? We're really gonna curse ourselves. I'm okay with that. I think okay, that's part there. of the appeal here. Okay. Here we go. Who are these people in the audience? Stop hitting. There we go. That slide kick's gonna be Mario's best friend. Yes, it is, but it's one of the easiest moves we can do. Oh, man. Fireball. Fireball's kind of worthless, in my opinion. <laughs> <laughs> yes! 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 Oh, you, you, okay, if you don't, if you don't stop, no, if you can't, if you don't stop hitting, I can't throw. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why do you side me? You're so many stronger moves than that. Oh! Uh, no. Up, up, up! Okay, okay, we're good. Yeah, recovery wasn't necessary. Performing smash attacks, by the way, is a nigh impossibility like this. <laughs> so we just basically have to win a war of attrition? Basically. <laughs> we're, doing, we're doing alright. I mean... Alright, let's, let's see if we can land a smash or two. Okay, ready? Here we go. Okay, that wasn't a smash. Yeah. Yes! Yeah! That was... Okay, yeah! that, was, that was fucking nice. It was. That was nice. Get out! Kirby. Fuck you. Gotta grab my bear. Gotta grab yeah. my bear. I am drinking. Ladies and gentlemen, I am drinking an alcoholic nice. beverage. Because I fucking want to. So when was the last time Pit was relevant <laughs> oh before this game? So we have a pile of games next to our TV. I just put the beer. <laughs> Not okay. Which one did you put it next to? All of them. <laughs> Especially the nearest one. Uh, an extra large game, <laughs> I would say. <laughs> Uh, Who are you people? Okay, so now I have to fight the criminals. Yep. 
I love the name. I love the design. I thought this was really original when I was younger. See, that's kind of my problem with it because, like, my my thing about this is is like we're doing we're like trying to do this game as a shared Nintendo universe. I'm kind of pissed that the primates take up so many of the enemies we fight yeah. because it stops you from fighting cool shit like you know like Skulltalas and. Like, uh, like, Mario enemies are in this game, granted, but... Yeah, but I, I don't know. I think they, they, okay. Oh, God, okay, so... I want to play Peach. <laughs> Fuck you! No! God damn it, Michael! Did we just back? I didn't even know you could do that! No! Wait, we did? Oh, my God, we did! I never knew we could do that either. Yeah. I don't need you. God damn it! God I'm damn a, it! I'm a feminist on Tumblr. I don't need you. I don't need you, penis. <laughs> I don't need you, logic. <laughs> I, I'm a feminist on Tumblr. I'm very offended by the very presence of Peach. If she wasn't in this game, I'd be. My God damn it, Michael! I'm me, I'm me. God damn it, Michael! I blame you. I blame you. Okay. At least we'll be Mar. Oh, yes, we will. Okay. I'm a masculine person on Tumblr, and Mario's presence offends me. Mario should be more conventionally masculine. Are we really just gonna rip on every Tumblr feminist? Uppy, 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 uppy. There are plenty, there are, like, Tumblr patriarchs exist. No, I mean, okay, yeah, here's, the I'm thing. At right now. here's the thing. Here's the thing. Feminists. And people who get really mad and are illogically more offended on Tumblr are two very different. No, things. no, completely. Hence why, hence why Tumblr feminists and you know, legit feminists are two Like when we're talking different. feminists, we're talking people like. I mean, I can't name any actual activists, <laughs> but we're talking. <laughs> okay, I'm not educated. But like people like you say, people who motivate them to be who they want to be, aren't they? People who fight for equal rights, watching um, people with no variety. I like Emily Watson. I like Beyonce, come on. I don't dislike Beyonce. I'm just not a big Beyonce music fan. Blood, we're... Uppy, uppy, uppy. Yeah. yeah. That was a pathetic record. <laughs> See, ever... Okay, guys. Every time we go off the edge, it's like... What the fuck do we do now? <laughs> <laughs> like, a casual recovery from an avid Smash player is like hell on earth for us. Because <laughs> we really have to concentrate more. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I think mean, there are a lot of people who give feminism a bad name. Because a lot of what feminism is, it's about equal rights. Yeah. Equal consideration. Equal consideration, you know yeah. what I mean? Mm -hmm. Inclusion of masculinity and femininity. And but now, now that, you know... Just, and look, look, I, I do think it's difficult to articulate this, but like, it's not just Tumblr feminist fault, it's also fucking idiots fault who, you know, mistake that for the real deal and, you know, have become, yes, and, yes. Have, and for that reason have become uncomfortable with but the But I think we kind of help that when we make jokes. <laughs> what are we doing for the world? God damn it, Michael. We're, this is a comedy show. If you gain any, if you want education from this show, I, I thought you were gonna be. I thought you were gonna try to up me. Up me. I'm a side B when I do curve. I know, but up is more effective. Than this up me! Oh, God damn it! <laughs> okay, try it again. We both basically just mashed the button and hope that it yeah. times right. <laughs> so, if you want to learn anything. From Maybe, maybe we should. Maybe we need to cut the relatively smart moments all together so that no one can ever mistake this for being a show of any intelligence. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> no, no. I, I like. I, I didn't, like us. I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that seriously. <laughs> if anybody's ever going to watch this, guys, put the comments. Good feminist book that we can read yeah. and educate ourselves. God damn it, Michael! And that we can recommend to others. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Yeah. So that we can all be more educated. Look, if you want any sort of education in the show, just know that, you know, autism speaks is literally more evil than <laughs> Oh my god! Is this gonna come out before that episode? No. You should make it come out <laughs> Literally more evil than Satan. Okay, we're gonna down here. I tried. At least 
here at the very beginning of the game like you know he's the first boss enemy you fight but how many other nintendo based you know bosses are there in this Dude, game do you want to play bastion on this show i have i have no idea i don't i don't either i i feel like that game's narrator would be fighting us for attention okay I agree. that'd be a three person let's play <laughs> that would be perfect though we could like act like we're talking to him no that wouldn't work you want, oh, you, I, I never got the arrow gun. I never understood why it was an arrow and I anything. I don't either. I don't like how he's like holding Zelda by her hip. There. <laughs> why? I don't know. Because just you're gonna... a feminist. <laughs> <laughs> we just had, this, just looked we had this long conversation about how the shit we say oftentimes, you know, feeds into this. You know? Yeah. <laughs> we say yeah. Just, what was... Uh, what was what? I don't know. Uh, we should we should play the Beginner's Guide. The Beginner's Guide to what? It's called the Beginner's Guide. You saving it? Yeah, I save it. I save save over that level. one? Yeah. Okay. I save after every level. Because it's not an inconvenience or anything. Yeah, the Beginner's Guide is made by the guy who made the Stanley Parable or whatever. It's a, so it's a game? Yeah. Okay. It's a really existential mindfuck. Okay. Oh, yeah. You, I oh, start... so you're, you spo you're spoiled. Though. You already know what it's about. Yeah, to a degree. So you can't but play it. I'd like, to see me, I'd like to make my own interpretation Michael, of it. Michael, this is about new experiences. Do you, do you know anything about Undertale? I, I know that... Uh, you know what I know about Undertale? What? I know that one of those, uh, you know, self-serving religious assholes... Had some problem with it, so I love it. <laughs> like Jack Hatch or one of those motherfuckers. Like you know, some some concerned mother wrote you into him. You know what I've noticed about this show? We are unapologetically liberal. <laughs> <laughs> I am not whole. I, I I consider myself a moderate. Yeah. Oh uh, no. But <laughs> <laughs> no, I think we're both pretty moderate. There's... But we're like the aggressive moderates. Yeah. Well, you know I. So, so this mother wrote in to, I know about, I know the twist of Undertale. I don't know. I don't know if that would be the twist. I think that just made things harder. <laughs> yeah. So, so this concerned mother wrote in to Jack Hatch or somebody, one yeah. of the, one of those assholes. And she mentioned how she went through her daughter's phone and she found yeah. all these pictures of this skeleton with one eye. Yeah. And she was concerned about this. Okay. And Jack Hatch was like, you know, why, why can't there be someone making, you know, why, why, why do all video games have to be so violent? What? And the entire cornerstone of Undertale, of course, is that you can play, it's an, it's an RPG with a pacifist route. What, like, wh what? In terms of what Undertale or what no. Jack Hatch? Jack, what Jack Hatch? I don't know if that was Jack Hatch, but. I'm sure it was just a blatant assumption. Yes, people who say video games they have a point that video games, I don't know by artistic design would you let me move. Holy no. shit. We must always be fighting. That's how we'll fight. Okay. I the point that video games I am an avid gamer, uh -huh. but I like games that aren't I don't know, aggressively violent? Not like, for, I will pick up a platform over a first person shooter. Does that make me better than anybody else? Can use it? Um, do I think platformers are just inherently better than first person shooters? No! I love it. <laughs> uh, do I think that? <laughs> yeah, okay. But I mean, I guess. But the, the thing is, is that yes, there is a growing, there is a big trend in violence in video games. We're playing a violent one right now. There's violence in almost every video game. In some form. Does that make it bad? No. It's a fictional experience. It's a matter of, you know, you gotta... Look, know your kids is the thing at the end of the day. Exactly. Right? Exactly like what I said about this show, you okay, know, go. months ago. Right? When I said, you know, if you're a child who's not going to hear a couple of guys on the internet 
screaming cuss words, <laughs> and as a result of that, it will one day turn you into a homicidal rapist, then by all means, if you're a child, watch our show. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Oh, that you're not that. Yeah, okay, yeah. I was. I thought. Okay, okay. Misunderstood what you said. <laughs> no. <laughs> thought you were encouraging this country homicide needs... and rape. <laughs> I thought that's what you were saying. Okay. Anyway, I, I just. There have been studies. Okay, there have been extensive, twenty-year-long studies where they take kids, have them play violent video games, and watch them grow up. <laughs> and guess what? They're normal fucking people. I mean, before video games, you know, it was, it was whatever was before this. It was rock music. It, 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 yeah, and that's called juvenile. Put that on. Why are we so deep on I, this this fucking channel? Is it because we can't be funny. <laughs> I think we I think we can do both. I, I think we're good at doing both. Yeah. Oh, you timed that wrong. Time that right. Yeah. Look, here's the the thing about. And you know, I'm kind of just passive. This I wonder, here. I wonder if like you know, when I'm older, when I have children, if I'm gonna you know hate their new form of media. Oh sure. And I'm gonna be worried about it corrupting them. I'm sure we will because I'm sure it'll be something we I'm gonna be, haven't I'm, thought of. Look, I'm gonna be honest though. I'm much less worried about you know my children's. Uh... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! You got us under there, you fuck. You no. Bullshit. I wanted to jump and you hit. You always hit. Oh my god. I think, we're, I think this is going to be the trend. <laughs> so look, I'd, I'd be way less worried. I'm going to be honest. I'm, I'm just way less worried about my children partaking in, me in violent media than I am them partaking in shitty media. <laughs> and so, someone observed that, like, you know, our generation's parents said, no, you can't play this game, it's too violent. We as parents are going to say, no, you can't play this game, it sucks. <laughs> yeah, maybe. There's a lot of our generation that really doesn't play this game. I'm talking about the Kardashian watchers. Oh, God. There are a lot of people who watch that kind of stuff. Yeah. And they are part of our generation. I, I mean, I, I experience it in my work life. How, how does that happen? Okay, how, can we get this? No, no, we gotta Get this! Can, I don't think we can one-shot him, though. That was the wrong way. Yes, it was, control guy! That was you. <laughs> you weren't pointing upwards. That was me. That was me. I'll admit. Fuck you. It doesn't matter if you get on that. Not frankly. So, how does that... I, well, we can't talk about your job. I know. Well, we can talk. But. I have experiences with people who are my age who talk about Kim Kardashian. And I just I find don't that give I, a just, shit. I just find it hard to believe, given the work environment you work in, that you attract people of that sort. But oh I, well, I'm, there are pe all walks of life. All right, fair enough. There was a guy who came into my store, huge, six four. Yeah. I would say six five. He was built like a fucking tank. All right, he had tattoos everywhere. Yeah. And there was a tattoo. I swear, I shit you not. Uh -huh. On his right bottom leg, there's a fucking tattoo of Rainbow Dash. And I, <laughs> I walked up to him and I said, "That is an awesome tattoo." <laughs> Noise. All walks, I... of, all walks of life, man. Okay, here we go. No, I, I, I think part of our generation is going to be the way we are. But I think another part of our generation is going to be exactly the same as every other generation. I, you know what I mean? A bunch of the the that there will be There's a whole, fuckheads. There are a lot. There is a lot of. Hey, we apathy. already beat the level. There is a lot of apathy, dude. Oh man. Uh, we're talking like it's funny because we're talking about this the week of a big DC comic event, which dealt very heavily with idealism versus apathy. Well, we're also talking about this on Memorial Day weekend, where we That's, mm. honor the deaths of our fallen soldiers. Wow. Also that, which we... <laughs> if, 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 if we're talking about fucking apathy, you were talking about comic books before we talked about that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here, get the sword. Get the sword! Okay. Memorial Day is just about barbecue, right? <laughs> exactly! It's, Welcome it's, to our country! It's in memory of the of the pigs and beef that was slaughtered to make our Memorial Day barbecues. 
Okay, would you... Would you... Say something that won't get me sent Say to something hell. I'm giving up on you. <laughs> oh, I hate that song. I love that song. Oh, that guy, that guy sounds like such a wiener. <laughs> Why? He just, he just sounds so whiny. I love that song. I think he sings it very well. Uh. Get him, 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 get him! Yes! We got some food out I never was able to get all I fucking hate these things. Fetishes? Would you sure for fucking fetish? What about the sheep? I can take care of these. I generally try to kill them before they get me. Yeah. Okay, that's gonna be her power move right there. Well, yeah, I mean, that's my favorite part of the game. And that she she upskirted a lot in this game. I wh what? <laughs> oh, absolutely. Oh, damn it. Okay. That damn it, Michael. I can't believe that wouldn't work. <laughs> God damn it! You made yes. it worse. That was awesome. <laughs> Power of Peach's ass. Okay. Power of Peach's peaches. <laughs> Shut up. Aren't Peach's boobies? Though? Holy crap. I I've always thought a peach looks like an ass. Did asses look like peach? No. What what came first? Did we evolve ass? did we evolve asses first? Did we okay, are you saying that primate oh like we're talking Uh well okay. What buttocks. are you talking about? The butt or yeah. the ass that is a, that is a human ass? Because that is very unique to humans. Yeah, yeah. Humans are primarily, they hunted by outlasting their prey. Right. They just distance ran until the gazelle was out of energy and then killed them. And the and ass had something to do with that? That's our gluteus. Just keep doing that while we talk. <laughs> that's our gluteus maximus. That's yes. that's the mo one of the most important muscles in that regards to stamina while running. Is this intentionally missing frames? This is, let me go. Okay. <laughs> let me go. So, yes, it is a very human trait. Huh. Where chimpanzees and bamboo and baboons, although they do have asses, are not nearly as disproportionately large as ours. Please. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's why a good ass is attractive, because it it supports the idea that that person is in a good health and would be a good mate. You really are just dead. Oh, absolutely. We are absolutely. But just... Uppy, 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 uppy. But... But, but ass peaches or peach peaches? I think peaches would be more so. See, here's what I remember. I, I remember... I remember one of my crew. No, not these! I like these guys are cool. These guys are fun by me. They're gonna kick our ass sideways. Well, get up there so we can break the portal. Time to do that side hammer action, man. I, I, do, I do not like what they did to the hammer. Oh my god. Let's, let's down me, down me! Yeah. You gotta get break out of that. No, I don't. I was doing everything to break out of it already. I, I remember reading uh, Winter's book in the creative writing class, and uh, it's set in the Ozarks. And there's a scene where the narrator, who's a young woman, uh, has an interaction with uh, her friend who has a baby, and she's talking about her. She's breastfeeding. Wait, damn, sorry. those peaches are big. I, I don't see it. I'm sorry. Like, you could say melons and I get it. You might even be able to innuendo peaches and I would just get it by rule of association. But, you don't, but you, don't, you don't picture. No, I do not. Yeah, neither do I. Fair enough. I, I don't think I really do either. Do we go down? That was a not a good wow. move. Wow. Holy crap. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Peach time, please. Yeah, you can get gratuitous upskirt. I don't <laughs> I don't care about her gratuitous upskirt. Peaches, peaches. I just get up to the portal. Would you stop? Let me, please. I'm not doing anything to stop you. Hachai! Damn it! Thank you! Now we can stop pressing B. Nice glide. Yeah, you can yourself over there. You make it so fucking hard! 
Stop pressing buttons and let me run! <laughs> Holy crap! This is Smash Brothers. There must always be Smash Brothers. No, this is Run Brothers! This is Run Away <laughs> from everything! Run. Because we can't fight to save our life. Yes. Yes. That's very optimistic thinking. Did you like that glide? That was very nice. <laughs> Ass! Ass! Ah! Blades! <laughs> <laughs> Okay. No. That wow. was okay. That was cheap. I didn't. I didn't see that coming. Yeah. Cause maybe I thought you were gonna try and hammer. Why would you think that? I hate the hammer. How can you hate the hammer? Okay. Um. So, <laughs> guys, we were considering putting this on very hard. Or even intense because we had because we had a relatively easy time with the first two levels. We're not doing out like outright horrific right now. I know, but that that right there proved to me that we need it <laughs> on this level. I I, I always love these cutscenes. They always made me feel I don't know. As a kid, they gave me that sense of I don't know, imagination, wonder. You know, uh, these cutscenes being on YouTube is why there is no story mode in Smash 4. Why? Because Miyamoto, not, not Miyamoto. Uh, no, oh, wait, no, 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 uh, no, what's no. his fucking name? Hideki Kojima? Hideki? No, that's, no. that's... That's Metal Gear. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what the fuck am I talking about? Uh, Kishimoto. Oh, no, Kishimoto's Naruto. Fuck. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> Sakurai! Sakurai! Oh my god. Masahiro Sakurai. Yes. Sakurai. Uh, put a uh, soccer I felt they put so much work into these cutscenes, and then so many of them got spoiled before the game came out. It was like, fine, fuck it, you're gonna do that? I I'm not giving you a story mode again. <laughs> fuck you, Diddy Kong. And fuck you for <laughs> selecting Diddy Kong. I like Diddy Kong. I hate Diddy he's Kong very in these mobile. games. No, I think he's perfect. Okay. Well, now we're now we're diddly dong. You're hiding until it until it unjusts. <laughs> <laughs> diddly diddly dong, he's expand dong's nephew. Expand dong. Let's stop hitting, let's just, stop let's, mashing. Let's it. just do that to traverse the level. No. Just hold right. Just hold right and let's do that to traverse the level. Okay. It should be secure. I really want to I see if we can. I swear if this works. Well, I mean, when, well, we yeah, get locked, we when we have to jump and get locked into the yeah. yeah. If this works, that means, like, 70% of the subspace emissary <laughs> can be foiled <laughs> by choosing Diddy Kong. And it fucking... <laughs> that would be the most boring let's play ever. <laughs> but I'm willing to hold that time. This is all you, man. Well, just jump on them. I'm not gonna attack. Side B! No. Yeah, fine. Now we're too big for the door. Are we? No. <laughs> Diddy Kong's like the only character who isn't. That'd be true. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? This is a good game. <laughs> oh, now we gotta go up. I don't think we did. Because we've been ignoring most of the secrets thus far. I don't think this is a necessary door, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. I hate the Jungle Japes levels. I mean, I like yeah. them, but I hate them. I, ha I hate the- it seems to be between Brawl and Smash 4 we've lost most of my favorite iterations of series levels. Because like, I loved Foreside way more than Honor. Yeah. I loved the other Donkey Kong level way more than I liked the one that they used. Yeah. The one where, you know, it's got a bunch of wooden platforms. There's that one in the- there was a log that occasionally came up in the corner. Are we not side being anymore? Well, I mean, you know, we can't do it in an enclosed space. Yes, we can. Alright. <laughs> and, and yeah, we're- Yes, we can. <laughs> yes, we can. Here, throw this real quick. Yeah. Fuck you guys. 
vow to not do this until we at least get to the actual subspace levels. <laughs> oh shit, it's not gonna work here. I will, I'll believe it when Diddy Kong is dead. Okay. <laughs> Even if we don't kill them, it pushes them off. Which kills them. Stop pressing B. I was kind of hoping we'd trip, I mean, we'd trip backwards. Yeah, get out. No! Up me, up me! Oh, you gotta hold it, too. I, I don't play diddly dog. God damn it, now we can't do it. We can kill ourselves. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're so good at this. <laughs> yes, we are. Oh. All right, diddly dong. Here we go. <laughs> that's surprisingly that, that's a strong move. I liked killing Goomba's like jump on them best in this game though. Maybe I just like that. <laughs> I mean, we could have easily jumped on them. Yeah. And that would have killed them. Okay, now we have to fight Dark Bowser, I believe. Or is it Rayquaza next? I, I, feel I think it's I'm... Rayquaza next. Yeah, and we also get to play as Fox. For that. No, we don't. I think, yeah, We Fox... can play as Diddly Dog for that. I said also. I, I know, but we're going to play as Diddly Dog for that. I have no idea how well this strategy is going to work in a boss fight. Hey, is our episode over yet? <laughs> No, let's just make it last this long. No, I'm, I'm... Yeah, first one, first one 30-minute special? Hell yeah. Fine. See you guys next time.